What are you doing in the house, guys? Hello, guys. Welcome to my channel. I am Sarah Pedun, and in this channel, we talk about all things gardening. So in today's video, we are going to plant Bacella, also known as Malabo spinach or Indian spinach. If you're seeing me for the first time, you are so welcome. And for those who have been watching me and for my old subscribers, welcome back. There is a backstory to how I got this plant. I went plant shopping a few days ago and I got some plants. And then when I saw this, I was like, I want that plant. There is a lady I always buy plants from. She wasn't there. So she, this other guy who helps her around to, to sell the plants. So when I told the boy I wanted this plant, I did not know it was a spinach. It was a type of spinach. I thought it was a crawling ornamental plant. And I love the colors. Guys, it's beautiful. So I love the colors and I paid for it. I paid the amount she had told me. So when the lady came back, as we were packing the plants, she told me, you can take that for free. I'm like, what? Then I was like, I already paid for it. She's like, no, you can take it for free. I told her, it's okay. You know, she always gives me an extra plant or two every time I buy from her. So it was okay that I paid for it. She told me that is an Indian spinach. I got the seeds from a certain lady and I threw it here and they sprouted everywhere. So you can always have them for free. I was like... This is a spinach. I told her I was buying it as an ornamental plant. Guys, it's beautiful. You could pass for that. And thank God for YouTube. I went on YouTube and searched about this spinach. And I was amazed. What? I was so excited. Because it is a perennial. I was so glad I saw it. So my home area where I come from. Eastern Uganda, Teso region to be specific. Uh, sometimes there's famine. It's so hot there. So what am I trying to say? If I have a perennial, I'm going to give it to all my neighbors to have. I'm going to give it to all my neighbors. Sometimes people don't have what to eat. And if they can plant this, wow. And it's easy. The lady told me, you know, I have very many growing there. When I saw them, I was like, what? This is one of the, the seeds. This one has grown from seeds. I'm going to remove a few seeds and plant. And you can also grow them from cutting. So I'm going to, I'm actually going to cut this way back so I can have fresh plants. I'm told when they're, all, they're, they're quite old, they're not very tasty. They're slimy. I don't mind the sliminess. We eat okra. And when I get such plants, I get really excited i'll take some seeds for my dad and plant them i'm going to give seedlings or seeds to my neighbors back home back home in soroti i'm, I'm so excited and i make pinatas so i'm going to use this as dye one time i'll show you i'll also use this as dye Uh, someone actually said we should stop calling them Malaba spinach or Indian spinach. You should call them Bacella. So the first method to planting Bacella is other seeds. So you can plant the seeds straight away or you can dry them and save them and plant them for the next season. I'm going to do both of them. I'm going to plant this straight away and I'm also going to save a few seeds for the future so i have one hen here that keeps escaping or you can take a cutting from the plant and it will sprout i'm going so i'm going to dry the seeds i'm going to take cuttings sometimes i don't really put them in water sometimes i just plant them straight to the ground i've tried that that with the dahlias and i've done so well and a few other plants so i'm going to put in water I'm going to plant a few in water, plant directly, sow the fresh seeds, and also dry them.
seeds are down here. Also, the kids are going to have fun with the seeds. Squashing them up and maybe dyeing peppers. I can't wait to do that with them. I haven't showed them this yet because they'll get impatient. So like I said, I'm going to plant some fresh like this and I'll dry some. Seeds grow like coffee. I also read somewhere that you can add the seeds to your smoothies. So I'm just so excited about this plant. So if you like my kind of content, and you haven't yet subscribed kindly kindly subscribe it really helps my channel i'm going to look for where i can plant the cuttings and cut this all the way back up to here i can see some new plants growing but I'm not going to do that now because I don't have where to put them and it's so hot right now. It's really hot so I don't want them to just get wasted. So I'm fetching rainwater to go and water the plants. The tank is quite small. Sometimes when there's a lot of rain, it spills over. I just poured everything. I'm going to start this in water.
here I have radish growing and I have this trellis that I put up for the beans I'm going to put the I'm going to plant some spinach in between here I think about three plants will be enough for this space but I'm just going to multi so I've never seen radish flowering. Do they flower? <laughs> this one is so big. I'm just going to leave it here and see what happens. I like a few in my salads, but I don't really like radish so much. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. Salamat so much. If you have enjoyed today's video, do not forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, kindly consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next one.